Good evening, YouTubers. Hope you're all well out there. And I hope you're all looking forward to dry roads, long evenings, and a lot of fun. Um, because spring is on its way. So first thing I want to say, cheers. And good health to you all. Uh, I've managed to pass 500 subscribers, which to me is absolutely amazing. Uh, I didn't think I'd get one subscriber. I actually started the channel as a project for work because I wanted to get better at talking to a camera. YouTube. And I was doing some stuff at the time around projecting yourself on camera, so I thought I'd better get good at it. At the same time, I just got the RT, and so it became a thing to talk about. So 500 subscribers later, and God knows how many comments and conversations and people and whatever. Just, it's very humbling um, that people watch this old man talk about motorbikes. So I suspect, and don't take this personally, I suspect an awful lot of guys, or an awful lot of my subscribers are almost mirror images of me, probably not got a lot of hair, might have glasses, might have beards, similar age, love motorbikes. So. And you're all around the world, so just thank you. Um, just thank you. <clears throat> Second thing, this is a dilemma. If you've been following my videos, you'll know I've had a bit of an issue with my, my BMW RT. And this video is titled Problem Part 3. Um, but the problem isn't what you think it is. The problem is actually a good problem, but I don't know what to do. So my bike got a problem, I've lost a bit of confidence in it, and I said in the video, that's it, it's gonna go, I'm gonna get something else. I have a lovely wife, I really do, she's fantastic. But when it comes to me buying motorbikes, it's not always the most constructive of conversations I have to say which normally means I have to lay the ground very carefully bring her around to the point where she reaches acceptance that it is going to happen and I can go and do it and we're all reasonably happy she has a lot of flowers and I have a motorbike you get the picture When I got, when she got back on Sunday and our bike was parked outside in the road and recovery were underway, and she said, well, why don't you go and buy a new bike? Oh, sorry? And she keeps repeating it. She says, you need to have a bike that you love and like and are confident in. Go and buy a new bike. The problem is I'm not sure I want a new bike, but... I have this golden ticket. I have a golden ticket to go and buy a new bike. Any bike I want. It's an absolute golden ticket. This is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory golden ticket stuff, except rather than there being six, there's only one. And she's given it to me. I I've never had this before. I don't know what to do. So, comments guys, what would you do? It's the golden ticket, what are you going to do? Or what am I going to do? It's the golden ticket. She's even agreed to drive me to Edinburgh so I can go and try motorbikes. It's the golden ticket. Tell me what I should do. Cheers.